Hi everyone, John Paul Brionis here from In Motion Hosting, and thank you for joining us for another video in our cPanel series. Today I'm going to show you how to create a file or folder in cPanel. Begin by logging into your cPanel account. If you don't know how to do that, a pop-up will come up on the top right of the screen. Go ahead and click that to go to our full guide on how to log into your cPanel. Once you've logged in successfully, we're going to navigate to the File Manager button here in the File section. Let's go ahead and click that. This is going to bring you into the File Manager. You'll be in the Home Directory by default. In this case, I'm going to create a folder within the public underscore HTML folder. So to do that, I'm going to open the public underscore HTML folder by double-clicking it here. At this point, I'm going to go ahead and create a folder within the public underscore HTML directory, and I'm going to name that uh, folder test folder. So to do that, I'm going to click the plus folder button here on top, which is to create a new folder. It's going to ask you to enter a folder name and also ask you where you want the folder to be created. In my case, I'm going to name it test folder. And I'm going to keep it within the public underscore HTML directory. So at this point, once you enter your folder name and the location you want to create it, go ahead and click the Create New Folder button. Notice my new folder is now listed in the public underscore HTML directory. I'm going to go ahead and open this test folder up. Now that I've opened the folder, I'm going to go ahead and create a file within that folder. In my example, I'm just going to create example.html. So to begin, I'm going to click this plus file button to create a new file. You'll see a similar menu to the one you saw when you created the folder. Enter the file name. You can also set where you want the new file to be created. Go ahead and change that if you want to change it. In my case, I'm going to leave it within this test folder. Then click the Create New File to go ahead and create that file. Notice my file is now listed within my test folder that I just created. At this point, I can actually edit the file if I want to add code or whatever I need to do to manipulate it. Thank you for joining us for another video in our cPanel series. Feel free to like this video or comment below so we can bring you more great videos in the future. Do you know the InMotion Hosting Support Center has thousands of articles, pictures, and video tutorials to help you out with your web hosting questions? It's something for everyone, from beginners to experts. Join our community and sign up with your Facebook or Google Plus for free swag, prizes, and discounts. Visit our support center at InMotionHosting.com support.